Welcome to our podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we dive into how our sun just left a 400,000 kilometer long scar on itself. Here's what happened. The sun has scarred itself, quite literally. A massive explosion on the sun's surface on July 15th left a canyon of fire, a huge mark that astronomers on Earth captured. The solar filament eruption happened on the sun's upper left side, releasing a powerful blast of plasma and magnetic fields into space. The event was of such a huge proportion that it left a fiery scar on the sun. The dent on the sun is 400,000 kilometers long and 20,000 kilometer high, according to Tony Phillips, an astronomer who works with spaceweather.com. He called it a Grand Canyon on the sun. Astronomers were already prepared for something like this to happen. They spotted an unusually large, cold and dense gas filament suspended above the sun's surface a few days ago. When it finally collapsed, the Solar Dynamics Observatory caught it on camera. Filament eruptions are common on the sun and are triggered by small instabilities in the sun's magnetic field. Scientists are not sure how long the sun will remain scarred. They will continue to keep an eye on it to understand when and how it fills up. The sun has been highly active for the past years. It has reached a solar maximum when it releases plasma and plumes of flares more regularly. Coronal mass ejections, or CMEs, are sent across space and impact planets with radiation. On Earth, this activity triggers auroras. Colorful auroras are generated when the solar flares and the matter released by the sun interact with the magnetic field of our planet. However, these flares and CMEs can also prove dangerous. They can impact astronauts in space who can suffer from the harmful radiation. Satellites can also be impacted, cutting off radio communication. However, the plasma eruption in the latest event is directed away from Earth. A month ago, the Sun released an X-flare towards Earth. The most powerful solar flare was unleashed from sunspot region 4114. Certain areas over the Pacific Ocean reported radio blackouts. Multiple coronal mass ejections, CMEs, were recorded in 24 hours from sunspot region 4114. This highly violent activity is expected to continue in the coming months. Scientists are regularly monitoring the Sun to remain alert and watch out for a solar whiplash. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.